little bit about your niche with the dulcimer and how you found that. I found the dulcimer when I was 13. Uh, I was a musical kind of protege on the piano. I, I liked folk music and I saw one at a party. I got one and I had this vision of getting a record deal and a big career, fame and fortune kind of yada yada. And I did. Two years later, uh, I signed with Folkway Records and my career took off and I did folk music. I innovated the dulcimer sound. Um, I created children's music, which really soared my music career. Uh, got kind of rich and famous and then uh, crashed and burned and then turned into a uh, what they call a life coach. I call it a life consultant using the dulcimer as a tool for clarity. And uh, well, it's really my niche. It's, it's my business. What is one attitude you'd like people to have? Serve people. And one key behavior or thing you would like people to do? Have integrity and do some deep listening. And finally, the best technique, tool, or hack to use? Is to listen to your clients and then pause. Because when you pause, often they'll start in on something else that they wanted to tell you, but they were afraid to tell you. Thank you for watching this highlight video from the How to Succeed podcast. You can subscribe to the podcast on iTunes, Google Play, and Spotify, or click subscribe right here on YouTube to get notices about future episodes. And remember, whatever you are, be a good one.